today for Food Tech, well this is episode, series 1 episode 2 of Food Tech, we'll be posting what, uh, um, a video every 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 like one or two weeks of my Food Tech. So today we're actually doing mints um, and spaghetti, bolognese. bolognese, that's it, I forgot the name. <laughs> so we've got some mints here, we've got some sauce, pasta and some more pasta. Right. So basically, let's go. Right, so um, so this is your food tech lesson. Mm -hmm. um, while Philip is, um, well, we're on lockdown, so he <laughs> can't go to school. While he can't go to school and he has to do food, food, do the cooking at home, we have decided that for a way of the school seeing what he's doing and, and for everyone to see what, what we're doing, um, that we're making a film, a series of films until he goes back. So that might be... One more, two more, we don't know yet. Yeah, probably. We'll, we'll see anyway. One, so, two more. Um, last time we did um, toasted pizza. To that, that was so good. Which was really nice. That was lovely, actually. <laughs> it was. <laughs> um, so, today we are doing spaghetti hollandaise. Um, I'll show Philip rough what he's got to do, and then it's up to him to do the rest. Okay, so let's get on. Let's so, first of all, we want to open that packet up. Okay. Move these over here. Because we don't need those right now, we'll need those later. So let me just get rid of the coffee maker. So how do we open this then? Oh, I know. Well, this over there, with that on that ring there. Okay. And you want to put that. Sorry, that round there like that. Because you need to hold that handle when you when you've done that. Other when you start so, browning the mints. So now you're going to brown the mints. Okay. That's the first thing you need to do is brown the mints. Okay, so get a knife and just make a hole in that and then pull that off and then put the whole lot of that in there. But turn it upside down in a minute. So that's it. Gordon, doesn't matter what knife it is. <laughs> so okay. There. That's all you need to do. <laughs> right. right. Open it up. That's it. Go on. That'll do. It'll come out of there now. No, okay. tip that lot in there, but turn it upside down. That's it, like that, because on there, as you see, there's a piece of paper. There is. There is. Go on, put your fingers on it. Oh, yeah. Right, see? <laughs> you didn't know that. Look what I've got in mind, brother. Yeah, that's no good, is it? Right, yeah, put that in there. That's it, and I'll throw that away in a second. Right, turn that up full blast onto six. I'll just give it a couple of, a few minutes so you can already start. You can already start just breaking that up. Oh, okay. Okay, because we've got to break that right down. So let me get that out of the way. And did you wash your hands? Um, I in the toilet, I did. All right, so you've washed your hands. Yes. Yeah. Well, I'm just going to wash mine again. I'm just that mint residue on my fingers. Okay. I don't want that because it's not. So, that's me. Nice walk. It's going wait, all right. Wait, wait for that to warm up. Once that gets hot and starts to sizzle, yeah. you want to turn it down to about four, and then we'll cook it off on four. Okay. Until we've got it to the point where most of the liquid's come out. Yeah. And then we'll turn it back up to full blast just for that last two or three minutes, just as when it starts to, you can smell it. But it starts to, you can almost smell the burning. Yeah. But just before that, and then you stop. And then you add the sauce. Okay. And stir the sauce in. And then we put that on a simmer and we cook that very slowly. All right. We give that for about half an hour and then we will put the, um, the pasta on. Is that good? Well, yeah. The, 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 I keep doing it. I keep going. Have a look. Yep. Yeah, right. Leave it alone for a bit now. Just leave it alone. No, right. What we want to do is I'll get. Get that plate there to put that knife, up, that spoon on because you don't want to be put on the work surfaces. That's it. On okay. There. We don't want anything else on there because that plate will then have to be washed. I'm going to go quickly put some there. Okay. No, I don't think that's better. Right. Come on. Right. That's it. Well, you know, you need to start moving it around now. Like turn this? it over, yeah, like that. That's it. Turn it over then. Right. Now it's doing that. Now we now we turn it down to four because we don't want to get. We want to still be breaking it up. 
So can I just give you a, yeah. a quick idea, yeah? Get it on there. I'm going to chop it. Okay. Like that. So it over and then give it a good chop. Yeah. So all the way around like that. Just keep chopping it. Mm -hmm. Like so, like that. And then you want to do the same. Make sure it's all kept, kept in the bottom of the pan. Come over that side for a minute. Let me get the big saucepan out. The one we're going to boil the water in. This is the one we're going to. I'll put some water in this for you. Turn that whole lot over, not just one area. Yeah? So you want, you want to scoop it all like that, and now start to smash it up, and then so it's all flat across the whole thing. So the whole thing is flat. No, you have to use the edge. Oh, okay. It has to be. The, you're trying to cut it up. Okay. That's basically what you're doing now. You're cutting it up. Right. So look, find a bit like that. And give it a peak. Okay. You don't want any lumps. You want to, any lump you see. You want to make okay. sure it's all in there like that. See that bit like that, and then just keep chopping it. Okay. Right there? Yep. Chopping it. Right, now we have Philip's got that down to a reasonable consistency now. It's almost it's, it's looking quite good. Um now we put it back up, we put it to six because now we're finishing the browning off. Right, so give it a good stir around then, right? That's it. That's it, okay? What we'll do is... Yeah. We're going to get it from the... Oh yeah, okay, I'll do that. We'll try to do that. Okay. So you have a bit on top, there's now a bit on bottom, and then you just okay, get it all off that. the edge, because this only wants to be a couple of minutes, so... Okay, I'll do it. Right, yeah. Mm -hmm. Couple of minutes and that'll be perfect. And then what we do is, what I normally do is turn it right off. Yeah. When Mama's here, I, and she does this, I, um, this day we normally turn it right off. Uh, and then add the sauce, and then turn it back up to about three. All right. How's it looking now? Yeah. Give it right, oh, right on top of the heat. That's it. Have a look. That's it, that, that's it, do that, a you know, couple more times now and then that'll do, right. Get it all wrapped around the edges so it's all rounded off. Right, so, do you want a quick shout out to everybody at school? Yeah, alright then, um, shout out to Taylor, Amy, and... What about John? John, 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 Come around here a little bit, if you don't because you want to make, make sure you don't what is lock it? the handle. The whole thing? Pour it all in. Pour it? Yeah, go on, pour it in. That's it. Right. Now, add a little bit of water. Okay. Not too much. I'll I'll do this bit for you. Is that boiled? That's it. Shake no. it around. That's cold. Put the lid on properly, otherwise it'll leak. Now get a really good shake. You want to get all the rest of the stuff out there, all the stuff that's on the lid and all that sort of stuff, and get that all out of the way. How are we doing? Right, that'll do. 
Take the lid off. Jesus Christ. Right, Wait. come back around this side so people can see you again. That's it, and pour that in. Right, give me that. Now give it a really good stir. I said stir all the mince in, and at the same time, put that back onto three. Perfect, that's it. Give it a, stir, a really good stir around. Oh wow, that oh, looks amazing. Make sure it's all stirred in 100%. That's it. See what I do is, right? Yeah. Just, yeah, okay, I'll do that now. Like that. And then make sure all the bits around the edge Go are in there as well. And then that part of it is now done. Now we want to cook that off now. I normally do just to make sure all in there for about half an hour. So we'll come back to that. So what you need to do is, once that bit comes up to temperature, yeah? Yeah. It starts to bubble. Mm -hmm. Reduce that down to two. Okay. Um, otherwise it'll, it'll go everywhere. It goes <laughs> everywhere anyway, but you just wipe it down so it's okay. okay. But this is a messy bit. I know we could put a lid on it, but we don't really want a lid because it adds moisture to it and it makes, we want that to dry up a little bit. We don't want it to get any wetter. If you put a lid on there, the condensation builds up yeah. and it makes it wetter. And it all makes it all yeah. drip. Um, have I had any of you like hit you in the hands? Well, yeah, I have. <laughs> Is it her? Yeah, it does. <laughs> That's why the tongue's just there. So I'm going to quickly do that. That's it. It's bubbling away beautifully. You think I'm too close? No, I'm good. That's it. 